and take you to the promised land. In volleyball, Highland Park is faithfully following the state's best player, T.J. Wanger. JT has already accepted a scholarship to UCLA, but he'd like to leave Highland Park with a state title in the trophy case. He's the difference in this game. He sets up his own kill. The blast. Highland Park pumped up for this battle with Glenbrook North. The Spartans could not match the Giants' intensity in game one, but they did trade nasty spikes in the early going. Shortly after the visitors had regained serve, the Giants went on the attack. A well-placed kill right here. Coming up, that would help Highland Park out. It was 5-1 Giants, and Glenbrook needed to score some points to avoid a blowout in game one. Every time the Spartans got something going, JT was there with a blast. JT leading the way. Highland Park builds a 9-2 lead in game one, and it was just a matter of time before Highland Park sealed the deal. As usual, JT Wanger would provide the big play. He lays the smack down as Highland Park takes game one 15 to three. In game two, the visitors played much better, but they still did not have an answer for the big man. Watch him switch hands in mid-flight. He drops it in for an early lead. This one's definitely worth a second look. He goes up with the right arm and just touches it with the left. That's sexy volleyball. Great play by a great player. Highland Park held an 11-6 lead in game two, but then Glenbrook North caught fire. The Spartans quickly would tie it. Plays like that. The score stood 14-13 Highland Park. When Wanger would put an end to the Spartans rally. Check out number four. He elevates for the game when he blocked JT Wanger. 21 kills and Mike Wheaton had 34 assists as number six. Highland Park thumps number seven, Glenbrook North, 15-3, 15-13.